Hey guys, welcome back to Lima Bean Living. In today's video, I am showing you what we got for a grocery haul from Costco and just doing a quick little pantry restock. If you guys are new to Lima Bean Living, welcome. My name is Emily. This is my motherhood channel where I take care of all things mom. And today we actually, is like Juan's first day of paternity leave, even though Jack is seven months old tomorrow. Uh, we finally, you know, we postponed it and we figured we'd finally go to Costco and get our IDs. So we did a little Costco run today and we weren't intending on like going and buying a bunch of stuff. So our haul today is kind of small, it's just kind of like impulse buys for us. And uh, on our way home, it was kind of cool. We saw these donkeys like crossing the street. And if you guys are new to our channel, we have donkeys like in the hills right behind us. So we see them all the time, but they're not always on the street when we come home. So it was kind of a fun little thing to see, but let me show you what I got. And then we're gonna go ahead and put this away. So we'll start with what we actually put away first. This is just the empty box, but this vanilla ice cream has gotta be one of my favorite ice creams. I eat it plain. It is just super delicious. It is expensive compared to just like, you know, Walmart brand vanilla, but it, you know, you can taste the difference. So we already put this away, but I wanted to leave the box out here so you guys know like what it looks like in the store. We also got some just like little snacks and treats and then Juan's favorite cereal and then out of the ones that were there, my favorite. So we got some breakfast foods. This um, two pack of bread, it was like $4 and my sister buys like a whole bunch cause her family's big and um, she actually says they freeze really well. So I'm gonna put one of these guys in the freezer and then we're gonna eat the other one since our family is smaller. But I'm excited to like give the freezing it a try because that way you can kind of bulk up if you are further from a Costco like we are and not have to like make a bunch of runs for nice fresh bread. And then we got butter. I probably could have gotten a whole lot more. We like to freeze them here and I take them out like as needed, but I use butter a lot because I love to bake. But this four pack will probably last us a, a pretty good while. Then, you know, since I'm a baker, gotta get my chocolate chips stocked up on that. We got some blueberries, strawberries, and grapes. Aubrey enjoyed going in the big refrigerator. And then we got some dried fruit. So Juan likes the chili blend or chili mangoes. I got regular dried mangoes for me. Mangles, dried mangoes. And then these are super delicious. They're dried strawberries. And I went to my friend's daughter's first birthday party and they had these and oh my gosh, you guys are so good. So we already had to break into them, but they look like this. Um, but they are like a very healthy fruit snack. <laughs> and so we were snacking on them on the way home. And then I was happily surprised that they have the Cafe De Vida mix there. Juan said that they didn't have them the last time. So we picked up two. These ones, I think last me like a month, maybe two months if for one. It depends on if I go to Starbucks or if I need like two in a day. <laughs> but got some of these. And then when I got my little treat drink, Juan got his. And then we got this, it was on sale. So we just figured we'd stock up um, on that because we run our dishwasher a lot. And there you go. So let's go ahead and put some of this stuff away. So in one of my previous videos where I talked about like a bag storage container, I mentioned I didn't have any snack bags and I realized as I was looking through like all of my closet stuff and all of my newborn stuff that I have a million gazillion breast milk bags 
I got them when we were in Texas because of our insurance. Like I was able to qualify for, you know, like free breast milk storage bags as well as some other like pumping supplies. And so I realized like these just make the perfect little snack bags and there's no way I'm going to fill all of them up with milk because, you know, I'm not pumping anymore in the middle of the night because Jack is, you know, not sleeping as great. So maybe when he starts sleeping through the night, I'll start pumping again in the morning. But for now, I am using these milk storage bags for snacks. And I figured I would just pack up, you know, serving size portions or twice a serving size for the strawberries at least so that Aubrey and I can snack on them together when we are out and about. Um, I Weirdly enough, I put one of the chili mangoes in a bag and one was almost two servings so I was just like you know what Juan's gonna eat more than just one mango when he grabs one of these for work so I just put a couple in and you know made it work for us but if you guys have a bunch of these left over you know use them for snack bags instead of running to the store and buying you know extra stuff that you really don't need. Here I'm just kind of prepping uh, just a little bit of fruit. Uh, these are cute little like fruit storage containers that the Dollar Tree sells actually. And so what I do, because if I prep everything all at once, it'll usually go bad. I just kind of prep, you know, this little container's worth and I can give it to Aubrey to snack on. And it just works out really well for us uh, at this moment in time. I'm sure when Jack gets older and he starts, you know, gnawing at all of the food that we have, we're gonna have to get a bigger storage container. When you kiss me, it's like the stars fall out the sky onto my heart to cover up what I don't wanna show. Aubrey, where did you learn that trick? Because my Jessica teaches to me. Oh, really? Yeah. Very cool. <laughs> you never warn about. So I seriously had no idea that Aubrey knew that trick. I still don't know if she actually learned it from her cousin or some YouTube video, but um, yeah, she just totally surprised me. But here I am prepping all of the strawberries because we're gonna be having some for dinner and then I will be packing up whatever is left over. up today's video don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you guys are new here i would love for you to stick around and subscribe and check out all my motherhood content and i will catch you guys in the next one to the end of the video. If you didn't know already, every Monday and Friday, you can find motherhood and lifestyle content on this channel. And since us moms have to do it all, that may mean yummy recipes, easy DIYs, mom hacks, cleaning and organization, or just a combo of everything. Please know that you are loved and you are made for greatness, and I will catch you in the next one.